Actually, I kind of want to talk to uh, this guy right here. Welcome to the Great Tree. By which I mean, tourists are not allowed inside. Sorry. I mean, you're not stopping me, are you? Kind of a guest of honor, though. I think, you know, I saved you guys and all. to go Do I need to go to Poshley Heights to actually go in the train? I'm not 100% sure on that one. Might as well see where uh... Might as well just go ahead and do it anyway. I just want to stay on this train forever. What sort of magics, uh, magics possess me? Who are you? That's a passenger, uh, Excess Express. Not to change the subject, but watching your health abro um, abroad is super important. You wouldn't want to get sick and spoil the whole trip, would you? Thanks, Goombella. It's not what I was wondering about. Hello, yes, hello to you. Thank you for accepting my request. I need three ingredients. A golden leaf of mystic egg and a kill mangle. Each one has an exotic taste and aroma that will enhance my mushroom dishes. Have you found them for me? A shiny golden leaf, that is it. Thank you very much. That puzzling mystic egg, this is it. Thank you so much. A colorful kill mangle, this is it. Thank you so much. Now, I have all the ingredients. They call to my palate and my skill, begging me to turn them into delic delicacies. Thank you so much, my friend. This is your reward. 40 coins. We solved the trouble. I think you can just sleep to progress it. Uh. Oh, okay. Go back. I can't remember if the original let you like prop. Uh. I can't remember if it did or not. All right. Bing bong, bing bong. Attention all passengers. Arriving at Rugport. Please watch your step and be sure to take all of your belongings with you. Thank you for choosing the Excess Express.
Uh, check my stats. A list. We are level 20. Okay. We're actually a level ahead of what I thought I was. I think it's probably because I wasn't accounting for the fact that I leveled up off uh, recording. I need my magazine. I lent a magazine to Mr. Lean and now I need it back and rather quickly. Please meet me at my vacation home in Poshley Heights, would you? You wonderful trouble solver. Turn my magazine to me. I'll thank you with a member's card to for piano parlor. I have to ask if you if you don't naturally live here in in Rogueport. But you want to put something on the help board? Do you like email? Well, do, can you send an email or do you mail it in? Like, how do you do it? I'm curious. These questions must be answered. It's so funny because I, I feel like I was going to talk more about the direct in this recording, but I really didn't talk about it a whole lot. Like, just kind of briefly mentioned that. Uh, it was just nice having a direct that actually made me yell and get excited, you know? I, like, I swear for the life of me that you could go back here? Like I knew, I know there has to be something here. So you accepted my request for aid with my little trouble, you delightful man. You, I just decided I very much want to read a magazine I lent to Jolene, but she lives in Glitchville, and that is very far from here, as you know. Could you go get it for me, you resourceful wizard? You, Jolene sh said, um, Jolene should be in the promoter's office at the Glitch Pit. Thanks, you're a fabulous dear. Probably gonna pick up that Mario and Luigi game. I'm very curious to see how they're gonna do it. I have to say, in terms of bringing that art style into 3D, like it feels like they did their damnedest to be very, um, what's the word I'm looking for? To pay homage, I guess, to the uh, to the 2D art style of the games, or even just I guess 3D, however you want to put it. Like, they wanted to capture that feeling as best they could for 3D. And I think they did a pretty damn good job. It looks a little funny. It, Like, I can't deny the kind of squash and stretch and stuff. Like, it... Oh, yeah, there's a star right here, right? Oh, you're here. Oh, oh, this is no good. No one will solve my trouble. Oh, right. So funny that I'm here just for a uh, different trouble. I'll get to yours soon enough, though.
Miscellaneous is just inside. Do you need something? Mm -hmm. Tuttle's magazine? Oh yes, I know that one. Alright, alright, I'll return it soon. Huh? I have to return it now? But that magazine... Okay, fine, give me a moment. Don't get the wrong idea, I borrowed this magazine as a promoter, that's all. I need to see what the fuss was about. It's not like I follow fads or anything. You got a wrestling magazine, a magazine of jewelers, tools. Eventually, Prince Mush. Eventually, we will uh, come back and fight you. I get, also, just something I want to note for that direct. There were a few games that I definitely couldn't help but be a little like, man, those graphics are just rough. They are rough. Um, like there's a Funko Pop game. And I honestly, on that one, I think that's just the, whoever's making that game, just they are not doing their best to. I didn't mean to go back up. Um, they are not doing their best effort to make that game look good on the Switch. Just the textures, the resolution, like, it, it just looks bad. It looks bad. And then, um, oh yeah, so Stray's coming to the Switch. And yeah, they're... <laughs> Man, I could see some very, like, it wasn't even subtle, if you ask me. Just as someone who's played the original, obviously, I could see the clear signs of where the game took hits. Uh, like, a lot of the environment, too, just took a hit. They, they took some heavy hits in the areas, graphically. And it's one of those things, like, enough first-party Switch games look good enough. But a lot of third-party games, just it feels like they don't, they're not willing to go as far or don't want to, you know. And I don't necessarily blame them. It's just, I don't think it looks good on the Switch's end when you have games that look so, just so far behind. And especially even with like, compared to other Switch games, you know. Because it, the Switch is in this spot where it feels like, unless you were making, unless you either put the resources and time into, make it feel like a dedicated switch game it just it can even look so far behind other switch games so i was definitely hoping for our for nintendo's next console to come out this year i really think this should have been the year for it to come out but what are you gonna do it's another year of the switch suffering and games looking subpar on it and poor and like, because every year it's only going to get worse and worse. Because eventually, like, developers, I would think developers would drop it at some point. Because eventually trying to uh, fit your games onto that system is just going to become harder and harder. I think probably for indies, it's fine for the most part. I just definitely for bigger AAA titles, it's probably really hard to try and uh, get games on the Switch running at reasonable frame rates and resolutions. Did you get the magazine from Jolene? You wonderful man, you. Here you go. Yes, this is the magazine I let to Jolene, all right? You are a true hero, thank you. Here's my thanks to you. Platinum card, a member's card that lets you play the boat, mi boat mode game. This magazine is very popular among certain celebrities. Everyone who is anyone has been spotted in a cafe with it under their arm. You solve the trouble. All right, so I think I'm probably gonna try and get these last two. I think it's two more helps uh, help me's done. The favor favors my cousin was calling them because it is getting a little late for me, and I was never planning on starting chapter seven this recording session anyway. Definitely gonna have to be a thing for next weekend. Um, but I was probably hoping to at least take care of a few more things for this one, but yeah, it's just getting, it's getting late enough that I'm 
Okay, like there are, I'm gonna have to leave a few things for uh, next recording session. Probably like reading the book and listening to uh, that guy, that guy's story about finding oil. I got one left. Okay, security code. I forgot the code to my briefcase. I'll be sacked for this for sure. Meet me in front of the hot dog stand in Glitchville. Um, I mean, the other thing too, I don't think I would have done it in this recording regardless. But uh, I'm obviously going to go back into the Pit of 100 Trials and try and get the item expansion. As I, I know I mentioned that a little... Not long ago. Not that long ago, at least. I might... What I might do is I might kind of start that off, off recording, and then when I get to floor 40, I would probably boot it back... Boot up the... The recording. That'd probably be how I would do it. <laughs> 